What is up everyone? Today I'm going to be explaining reasons why you should really stop writing cover song. Not to say that you really shouldn't write cover songs at all. I mean it's good to have some influences on your music, but you really shouldn't shouldn't really sh like you know if you're playing a gig or anything like that, it really shouldn't be any more than you know, I'm saying probably like one third of these songs you're playing, no more than one third should be cover song. One of the reasons why is a lot of people out there, they just, some people just get tired of hearing the same song over and over and over. People just get burnt out by hearing the same song over and over. And um, people also like to hear something new, something that already has not been written. For example, like, you know, a lot of times I would be browsing on YouTube and you come across all these lists of like, you know, guitar covers and all these uh, band covers. And it's like, why does everybody have to play cover songs? Can't you just write your own music? Just stop writing somebody else's music. Don't write any more like, uh, you know, go play a gig somewhere or um, you're recording your music, you're making a single or an album. Don't make the main thing stand that stands out being somebody else's, you know, music. Write your own songs. You know, it should really, my the way I see it, it shouldn't be any more than one third, one third at the maximum of songs you're playing should, should you know, should be cover songs. Anything more than that, you know, you, you just don't want to do, you don't want to do that. It's just, um, some people just get tired of hearing it. it you know, you want to create something new. Something that somebody hasn't been invented yet. Somebody that, something that hasn't been written yet. That's how you really get good at being a, you know, really get good at something. 